as always, thank you for watching and a very special Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays to everybody. Uh, due to the conditions of the world in 2020, uh, a lot of Christmas parades and such have been canceled. Uh, so we have spent the day, uh, me and Ethan and a friend of his and my wife LaDonna, uh, cleaning up, detailing our trucks, which they needed to be done anyway. Uh, so we're going to take this little Saturday and put on our own little Christmas parade. We've decorated the uh, rotator up and then we're going to do something kind of special with the other trucks. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what it is. You'll just have to wait and see. Ought to be pretty cool if it works out right. Here we go. This is the big rotator, truck number 11 in the Midwest truck fleet. All shined up, ready for our local Christmas parade. to the next one. And it's got a little Midwest truck Jenga planned for the parade. There's Ethan. Still working on cleaning up some of the uh, equipment. This is the newest truck in the fleet, number 17. The trail ease trailer. Trailer's empty right now. That's not going to stay that way. Let me hear rotator run in the back. I wanted to make sure the equipment is sparkly clean. This is Peterbilt truck number 10, as they call. Little peak. Again, the equipment cleaned up, ready for the parade. And then here is one of the rollback records, air belt number 15. large-scale parade in the uh, nearby community Cape Girardeau County was canceled um, due to the virus so we're gonna make a pretty decent showing at our very small local Scott City Missouri parade Jenga. Should be interesting to watch. 
two of them are helpers up in the air. Mr. and Mrs. Pratt, Ron's parents, will be driving this vehicle in the parade. Number 17. And Ron and I will be in the rotator. All right, so we're not gonna light everything up yet. We'll light it all up here when the sun goes down or maybe when we uh, finish doing what we're gonna do, but we're not gonna use all of our equipment, but we're gonna use number 11, number 17, our Trail Ease TE-801, number T1, Our Peterbilt Century 4024 20-ton towing and recovery unit. Our Peterbilt LCG 12 rollback towing unit. And our Dodge traffic control truck. So, like I said, we've spent, four of us have spent a long time cleaning and detailing they look really nice I'd like to be able to keep them that way but with working trucks sometimes that's hard to do uh, anyway from what I've got going on here I'm gonna stop can anybody guess what I've got in mind and no I'm not gonna tow that with that and tow that with that and tow that and tow that and tow, something along that lines but not exactly all right, here we go. Hey, Ethan, am I pretty well centered on here? You're my loading helper. You can tell by the keyhole slots in the bed. Uh, I mean, you'll make it, but you're a little over that side. Okay. Okay, you and Jackson want to start securing this and I'll start loading up there. Black is hard to keep clean. Needs a good coat of wax on it. But David has kept this thing hopping. Between me and David, David's David's probably put a whole lot more on it than I have at this point.
All right, I need my guiding helper for a minute. Then we'll, you can come back and finish tying her down. Wait, why did you? That's all right, We're, we didn't use these. They're okay. Yeah, no, let's I'll put that down. All right, time to guide me up, please. And remember where we gotta stop. And you got all the chains and binders out that we need, right? Yes. Okay. Binders, eight chains, we put four of each on either side. Excellent, good job, thank you. Ready or not, here I come. to tell you this is nerve-wracking but this is nerve-wracking just barely fits on this uh, trailer width-wise and this is a stick shift so I'm feathering the clutch and a brake all at the same time while watching Ethan trusting that Ethan's not gonna let me fall off she won't Duke's a hazard fan there with his uh, General Lee hoodie on. You said you wanted it uh, about with the hole, right? I think so, yeah. That's what we measured out earlier. Okay, I can't see, so. We'll try that, it's right behind it. Just lined up with the handle well, and the door. Well, what I thought I would do is we'll run, since we can't go forward, we'll chain the steer axle backwards and hopefully it'll keep it from rolling okay. forwards. So take me forward just a little bit more. We'll kind of split the difference. Make sure we don't roll off the front, obviously. Okay. That one ought to leave you just enough room. We good? Looks like they've got this one. Four point tie down, all secure, good to go. Here we all go. All right.
I didn't hear the last part, bud. I said, I think that ought to have enough room and we're still on the back. Okay. Yeah, well, I do really like that. Uh, well, insane shine. Okay. That. Well, let's, uh, I'm going to get it leveled out. Okay. And then if we can pull it forward some, we'll pull it forward some. Okay. Okay. If we don't need to, we won't. But all right, you guys watch here. Ethan, you watch between them because remember what happens. And I'm going to watch the chains up here. Hold on. What in the world? Should be. Oh. Yep, brakes are released. Okay. Dead, gum it. Also, what do you think about this right here? I don't know yet. How far forward will the action go from Just a minute, I'm gonna back up. Well, how far forward will it slide from here? Forward? Not much. Okay, we'll try it and then I'll put a little bit of Yep. Hold on, Dad. Let me back up with it. I hope. Lock inner axle differential. And that'll put more weight up here. And if not, we'll just tie to it with the really trucking. What? I said I really do prefer to look at that insane shot. That actually spaced out pretty good right there. Uh -huh. Boy, dead gum, this is a new part of the lot and this is so soft out here. All right, let's get her tied down. What are you looking like? About to run out of threads. All right, did you see what I did over here? Yes. Okay. Also what? I'm also very intrigued. Why? Huh? Okay. There's a, a keyhole. Drop the hook, just the tip of the hook down in there and put it in the first link behind the hook. In the keyhole slot.
first or second and then take and bring that bring that tight yep like that slack and you're good there. watch out so make sure Pawpaw can get it moving up with little Christmas masks. Number 17, don't have the lights on on it yet, just turn them on. But we've got number 10 all lit up. Christmas everyone. Happy holidays. Thanks for watching and God bless. There it is, our own little uh, Christmas parade.
Boom.